Developing right now, a tense standoff ends with a suspect now in custody after an attempted bank robbery, an hours long standoff in Portage Park. Let's get right to Suzanne Lemignot. She's live on the scene on West Addison Street 4. Suzanne. Rob, Erica, after police negotiated with the man inside this house here for about three and a half hours, there was finally a peaceful resolution. A young man, his hands up, surrenders to Chicago police about three hours before turning himself in. Police say he attempted to rob this Bank of America here in Old Irving Park. Implied a weapon gave the teller a note, but they didn't see an actual weapon. The person entered the building, didn't get anything. He made his way to a home here on the 4900 block of West Addison Street in Portage Park. You're doing laundry, and all of a sudden you look outside and you see a swarm of police cars? That's correct. I seen a swarm of police cars. I looked up in there. There was a chopper, and people were just watching down there, and all of a sudden the SWAT team showed up. From Chopper 2, you see a SWAT team member waving toward the houses on the block and a large police presence blocking the street. Nearby St. Bartholomew Catholic School was put on soft lockdown. I'm really, really scared because, I mean, we just got an email and I came over here. Now, the school let out around 3 o'clock right across the street from the house. The Chicago FBI now investigating this case. We're live in Portage Park. Suzanne Lemigno, CBS 2 News. Rob, Erica. Okay. Thanks, Suzanne.